I think we're off already. Um, hello, first of all. Um, this is the Saturday wrap. The Saturday wrap for the 10th of December 2022. Recorded on a Friday. <sighs> yeah. Anyway, um, this is me. Hello. Um, talking about my past week. Politics, tech, weather, lots of weather, things, news and oddities. Anyway, um, let us start with the word or phrase of the week. And is it Time magazine? I think it possibly is. The word or phrase of the year is goblin mode. Yeah, I hadn't heard of it, to be perfectly honest. And it's been going for a couple of years. It means going all out and uh, spoiling things and possibly whatever, like a goblin. Yeah, no. Um, the other one I think I should was Wordle. I'd rather go with Wordle, to be perfectly honest. But, hmm, ha. <laughs> um, anyway, moving on. Uh, the app of the week. There are actually, or there could be, two apps of the week. Um, I'm picking the second one because both of these apps were updated during the week. Um, and they were major updates and they were paid updates. Luckily, both of them aren't subscriptions and there were very positive reasons to update. I, lots of new figures, not just bug fixes, enhancements and such like. The app I'm talking about is Ferrite 3. Actually, you can get Ferrite free um, from my old um, payments, um, but I updated to the Pro version. Ferrite, if you haven't come across it, is an iOS app. Um, works on the iPhone and the iPad, and it's really designed for recording podcasts. You know, podcasts, those things with RSS feeds. If you call it a podcast and it doesn't have an RSS feed, it's just an audio recording. That's something that's annoyed me greatly this week. People who are talking about podcasts and not understanding what podcasts are. If you want really to understand podcasting and podcasts and where they're going, um, just look for the Podcasting 2.0 podcast with the podfather himself, Mr. Adam Curry, whose teeth have just fallen out. He's had major surgery on his mouth and such like. Um, yeah, get well soon. Although, yeah, Adam Curry. Anyway, um, the thing of the week, there are actually three things of the week. And I've sort of already mentioned one, uh, software updates. Yeah, don't come at Christmas, please. Although I suppose January is just as bad, to be perfectly honest, uh, expense-wise. Um the other things, coldness, we're in stable, high-pressure winter weather. And as the week's gone on, since from about Wednesday, it's got colder and colder. And even my trick of putting hot water bottles on the dashboard and de-icing fluid all over the place this morning, only half worked. Sort of holes in the screen, which you can now be done for. Uh, yeah, well... Anyway, things like that. And the last thing, strikes. Um, we've got a postal strike today. Um, we're going to have ambulance strikes. We're going to have nurses strikes. I think next week we've got railway strikes. Everyone's going on strike. Oh, yeah, um, airport border official strikes. It is, if you were in the 70s, another winter of discontent. Which is not very good, to be perfectly honest. But, yeah... I uh, just think of it as, well, I've had it before and I'll have it again and all that sort of thing. And uh, <clears throat> the Rona of the week, chip shops. I know I've mentioned chip shops before. <coughs> mm, that's about cough. Um, it was chip shop. Saturday lunchtimes, no longer open. Friday lunchtimes open, Saturday lunchtimes, no. Whatever happened to... Saturday lunch time, go to the chippy, tons of chips, sausage and batter, fish and chips, fish cake and chips, chicken and chips, chips and chips. It's a bit of a worry. I think people just got out of the habit. It's a small village and there are other places to go and they're just not making enough money. And there was another chip shop that opened, I think, during the Rona in the old Nat West Bank. They were from Tree Kenneth. 
I don't even know if they did actually open. They're sort of gone from there now. Yeah, but there you go. Anyway, last Saturday, didn't be no. Just went to Costa Coffee and then shopping and bought my a turkey crown ready for Christmas and used my Tesco's vouchers. I know you can get much more if you go for one of their um, partner things, but I didn't want to go for any of their partner things. And a small turkey crown will do for me. And then I came back and I completed my let's all replace the batteries in my air tags because they're all about a year old thing. Yeah. And also iOS 16.1.2. I was under the impression that that was only for iPhone 14s. But no, iPhone 13s, iPhone 10s, and I'm not altogether sure, but it might be a 6s as well. Um, so it was a, quite a few days behind in doing that. You don't need it for iPad OS. Talking of that, 16.2, I'm going with, is going to be out on Monday. You saw, you saw it. You shared it here first or whatever. Anyway, also on sun, Saturday, jumping ahead. All the bags, all the pots, all the everythings with potatoes in them, all emptied, all the potatoes in, chips for lunch. Um, Desiree, really, 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 really good. Like them a lot. Um, today, I've actually ordered some more Casablancas in um, big bags. Um, not the small black bags, but the big green bags, 40 litre ones. Yeah, there was a deal pre-Christmas. Caught me unawares, sort of bought them. Yeah. Um, Sunday, England won. Um, England, home nation, support England, well done. Up against France tomorrow, or today, if it's the Saturday wrap. But it's Friday, you know. Well done, England. Um, I have a feeling that the match against France will go to penalties. Yeah, okay. Right, and on Monday... Stroke. Well, it was Sunday as well. I first saw it. The Wild Beer Co. have called in the administrators, which is a shame because they are mixed fermentation, sour beers, tart beers, really good farmhouse beers, and they go in under. Well, they've called in the administrators. The good news is they have a place on Wapping Wharf in Bristol, which is, it must be trading on its own. That's still going. Christmas parties are being honoured. Um, if there's anything positive to come out of it, it's that. Um, but there are other breweries going under as well. Um, my opinion is there are far too many small breweries and um, just not enough money. Hospitality is going to take a hit this Christmas. Uh, sea strikes, uh, sea, sea fuel costs, sea everything else. It's going to be a very hard time. And I think this is just the first of many. Okay, what else have we got? Oh, yeah, um, I had some lights. I buy battery-powered lights. I don't even put them on the tree. Don't even put a tree up anymore because um, I'm an old bar humbug, which was on in the tumble this week, uh, the beer. Uh, anyway, tried them on Sunday. Yeah, what happened? Only the first five lit up. Took them back, swapped them out, haven't even tested them yet. Probably do it on Sunday again. Uh, Christmas is a time for failed LEDs, no doubt. Um, uh, 6A updates, Pixel 6A. Um, if you've got a Pixel phone, every month there is an update. It's at the beginning of the month, usually between about the 4th and the 10th. 6A updates, really good recorder that transcribes, either on or off the phone. I need to try that. Um, my typing's appalling, so um, yeah, that would be good. Um, and it was about 500 megs, so it was more than the usual 20 megs bug update. Uh, Wednesday hard frost. I think I mentioned the hard frost. Uh, and luckily, uh, my, uh, I had plenty of de-icing fluid. I still have plenty of de-icing fluid. And the hot water bottles are going well on the dash. Okay, uh, Thursday, the first of the updates. Mars edit. I seem to be moving towards... Um, the Mac, if for no other reason than my uh, desktop is an i9 Windows machine, Windows 10, and that's going out to support a 2025 uh, Apple Silicon, far more cost effective in terms of energy, uh, sorry, power per watt. 
so I'm looking that way and since I've had the M2 MacBook Air yeah that seems to be my main laptop anyway I'm blogging to WordPress um, there is a uh, blogging software that comes with Windows I can't even remember if it it's open sourced now um, but if you're using a Mac Mars edit and it now supports Markdown and I love Markdown and I'm moving over completely to the Mac so that was an update oh yeah Thursday key for batteries um, I need to replace those they're getting a year old and what with all the cold and whatever I need to have those batteries definitely working Amazon was your friend there um, and Friday today ferrite update and um, yeah lunch okay so there's um i suppose it's a waitress she brings the food out she very occasionally serves behind the bar but she said you haven't had the christmas lunch yet which i said no and then I explained the situation they don't do mint sauce anymore they started off with sachets and i used to have about 10 sachets of mint sauce because i'm a bit over enthusiastic on the mint sauce front um and then they swapped them for squeezy mint sauce and then they stopped doing mint sauce and then you could get squeezy mint sauce in tesco's and now you can't so um a jar of mint uh half used filled the rest up with vinegar took it in in a tesco's bag for life with a teaspoon sat at the table ordered it all on the app the beer came within two minutes which was excellent and then the um, turkey uh, lunch came within another two minutes for some reason i don't know why there are no roast potatoes there is a mashed potato made of maris piper it is lovely and creamy um there were four thick slices of turkey it was a good meal the potatoes could have been a little bit warmer leave them a little bit longer in the microwave please next time but i drowned the thing in mint sauce there is a video coming out later of me um just overdoing it completely um it was really good um 11.99 with a pint of purity gold and i might even have another one at some time near christmas but on a friday near christmas the christmas drinkers were out uh, you know the sort christmas jumpers you don't see them there normally it's good news for the pub because it was full um but christmas drinkers uh, are not popular with camera members because they don't know how to queue at the bar and they don't know what they want and they don't know which table they're on and they change their mind and it's christmas all over again anyway so um the football's back on tonight um newport tomorrow i'm gonna try the little tap house again because i did like it and a festive a tray of chips how are we doing 13 minutes hey not bad at all anyway upload this um i'll see the rest of the second half of croatia versus brazil it was nil nil at half time and thank you very much for watching um please send some festive comments in positive negative or i get some that i think are in russian i have no idea what they are so i just block them anyway um bye bye see if this stops now